Hello everyone. In this video, I'm gonna show uh, how to do computer vision on the Raspberry Pi using a GoPro. So uh, for this, we are gonna be using a HDMI uh, to CSI2 bridge, which is done by this company. In this case, it's, it's the B101. And as you can see, it's a, a, it's a small device that is connected uh, using the, the camera port on the Raspberry Pi. And this one has an input for an HDMI cable. So as you can see here, I am using a Raspberry Pi number three, a Raspberry Pi three. I have uh, this device connected the, B, the, the B101 to the, uh, via the CSI cable uh, to, to, to the camera port. I have a mouse, a keyboard, and a, and the HDMI cable connected to the GoPro. Mm -hmm. It's a GoPro Hero 3. So, and then I have here the monitor of the Raspberry Pi, and I'm gonna show uh, first uh, the Raspberry Pi to show uh, what the camera is seeing. So. Uh, it should boot up in a in a, little, in a few moments. So this is the the video coming for, from the from the GoPro, as you can see here. Uh, the GoPro, I I disabled the on-screen display on the GoPro, and uh, I'm just showing uh, the raw video. Okay. So with this, we can actually do computer vision stuff using the GoPro instead of using a normal Raspberry Pi camera. Which I have here on my on my vehicle. So uh, I'm gonna test uh, the face tracker, the face tracker that I have implemented in my in my in my libraries, which is uh, online and it's open source. Uh, and that one is uh, face tracker face detection .pi. So uh, uh, well, it's not gonna work. I need to I need to do. I need to do this in order to work. Okay, in a few moments it's gonna start. It's gonna open a new window. Uh, let me focus here. Okay, so uh, this one is gonna do the 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 face detection uh, using the GoPro. So uh, uh, if you can see, yep, uh, 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 uh. yep, it has to be front face. So it, it is it is detecting at a, a, at that rate, and it's working it's working nicely. Uh -huh. it, it, this is using the GoPro, so this is this is very different. So uh, of instead of just using the a, a standard Raspberry Pi camera, which is which is very very easy to to just use. Mm -hmm. uh, the next one I'm gonna show is uh, the GoPro trying to find a color. So uh, it's another one of my scripts. I think I'm gonna use color four, which I have here, color four. Then it's gonna start the GoPro. It's gonna open a, a box. I'm gonna set up the camera there. And this is a little bit much, much faster. So I have, I have a red stuff here, a red uh, clamps. Uh, so I'm gonna put it in front of the Raspberry in front of the of the GoPro, and this algorithm is gonna find a, and it's gonna track the red color, uh -huh, as you can see here. So uh, it's doing it very fast, actually. So I can do this thing fast. Uh, being the Raspberry Pi is not as fast as as using a normal computer, but the Raspberry Pi, the advantage is that we can actually put it uh, on a drone as the one I have here and do computer vision uh, with drones so let me see if I can get in the shot at the same time no it's complicated it's not finding there yeah, no okay well uh, that is it uh, the GoPro uh, providing the images to the Raspberry Pi and the Raspberry Pi performing the computer vision uh, in mo in almost real time, 
it's approximately like 10 hertz so it's not it's not very fast but it is it's like it's, it's sufficient to do to do position controllers doing doing this and uh, I also showed how the V101 works I am actually really impressed with this small device I didn't have to do anything to just get it to work uh, I just set it up and uh, plug it in and the rust uh, raspy beef work at the, at, at the first time so I'm I'm really happy with this one okay guys thank you oh thank you <laughs>